So we're going to take a look now at using our graphics calculator to work out the probabilities from a normal distribution, which is far easier than going to all the trouble with uh, normal distribution tables. So here's the example we're going to take a look at. It's about water bottles. And a machine pours water into plastic bottles. The mean amount poured in is 600 milliliters and the standard deviation is 18 milliliters. So this could be for something like a pump bottle um, where you have a factory producing them and putting the water into the bottles. Some of the bottles are selected for quality checking and if a bottle is found to have less than 580 milliliters of water in it, then the factory will decide that they need to recalibrate the machine to make sure it's putting in the right amounts of water. So what is the probability of selecting a bottle that has less than 580 milliliters of water given the um, parameters of the question that we've seen so far? So to watch the video with instructions on how to put this into your graphics calculator, you'll need to go to that YouTube video just here. It'll look a little bit like this. Um, and once you follow those instructions, then you'll be able to see that the probability comes out to 0.13326. So what if you wanted to do something a bit different? So instead of it being the probability that it was less than 580 milliliters, what about if it was the probability it was between 590 mil and 610 mil? Well, in that case, you would put your lower limit as 590 and your upper limit at 610 and read off the probability from your calculator. If it was the probability that it contains more than 605 millilitres, then you would put your lower limit at 605. And your upper limit, since there is no real upper limit on a normal distribution, we make it a really big number. Just like the first example you saw on the video of how to use the calculators, you made it a really big negative number. So our upper limit would be something like this. And then you can read off your probability straight from the calculator again. Much, much easier than using the tables.